Hi all and uh, welcome back to this small help video. Today we are going to talk about Wi-Fi problems and connecting to your local Wi-Fi. And especially the error message incorrect password is actually a common problem for a lot of users. And some users have actually asked me on my YouTube channel if I could do a video about this. So here we go. Here are some tips and tricks about this. So you get the incorrect password message when you're trying to connect, this can of course be because you don't have the correct uh, password for your for the Wi-Fi and of course make sure that you have the correct password. Also make sure that you are looking at small and big letters. If you have captions locked uh, set on your uh, keyboard or something like that. So make sure you are look into these uh, common problems. Another thing you can do about this, if I click, if you have another device that is actually already connected to the Wi-Fi you want to connect to, and it is an Apple device, you will actually be able to share your password. I have a, another device here, and this is an iPhone, and as you can see, it is actually saying share password. If I click this one, it is saying sharing and it says done. And you can see over here on my iPad, it is actually trying to connect to my Wi-Fi. It is actually connected right now and you can see it is already popping up with messages because it's on the Wi-Fi. So this is an easy way to make sure to get the correct password for your device. So sharing from another device is actually a very good method to get connected. If you don't have that option, you can go into your device. If you are already connected, make sure to say forget this network, say forget. This will reset all uh, connections for this Wi-Fi and uh, make sure to uh, have a few seconds just to get it reset. Then again, try again, put in the correct password say join and it will pop up with the error message again if i take my iphone again and here say share password done and it is connecting so this is a an easy way to to get this done another thing you can do is of course to reset your network settings if you go into general go into settings in here we have a reset network settings click on this one type in your passcode whatever that is and it will reset all network settings that you have on your device this of course you have to make sure that if you are connected to other wi-fi uh, in your parents house or at the office or whatever then of course make sure to have the password for those because that will also be reset with this reset network settings. So this is also a very good way. I use it once in a while on my iPhone if uh, my Wi-Fi is not working as expected and I have actually solved problem with this. Another thing is of course to look at your Wi-Fi router. This is an old one I have but just to illustrate it for you. Try to take out the power cable so you turn off your router, pull in the power again, your router will restart, wait for a few minutes to get it up and running again, and try to connect once again. And of course, the last thing I would like to tell you is also, it is always a good idea to restart. Power off your device, like this, power off and you will reboot your iPad and try to reconnect again. This is actually solving a lot of problems. So uh, rebooting your device is always a good idea. So these were the tips and tricks that I had for the incorrect password option, error message, use another device to share the password, do the forget, a network or 
reset your network settings and of course have a look at your local Wi-Fi router that can also be the issue that this is not working as expected. That was all for me today. Have a nice day and talk to you soon.